Hi everybody and welcome back to Active Adventures. Today we're at Greenpoint on Lake Macquarie, New South Wales and we're going to be learning about camping. So, let's, let's go, go on an adventure. adventure! We're at the beautiful Greenpoint Reserve on Lake Macquarie, New South Wales. And as you can see, we're surrounded by all this beautiful native bushland. We've unpacked all our gear. Now it's ready to get started. Now when you arrive at the campground, the first thing you want to do is find a place to set up your tent. Found it! Well, Brendan says he's found a spot already. That was a little bit too quick for me. Let's go find out what he found. Ta-da! But Brendan, the ground is uneven. There's rocks everywhere and there's an ant's nest right there. If it's good enough for the ants, it's good enough for me. Well, I'm going to set my tent up here where the ground is nice and flat. There's no rocks and no ants nest. Should we go get started? Let's get started. I've got the instructions. Do you want to share? <laughs> I don't need instructions. Well, I'm going to use the instructions. Let's go! So we've got our tents. Trav's got his instructions. I think we're ready to go get started. I agree. Now, for those watching at home, we're going to speed this up a bit. Not that it's a race, but are you ready? I'm ready. Let's go! Okay, I think I'm done. Let's just check those instructions just to be sure. All good, let's go check on Brendan. Oh no everybody, look at Brendan's tent. I think he should have used the instructions. Let's go help him out. Hey Brendan, can I give you a hand? Um, no, 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 it's um... Done, finished. I think we need to do those air mattresses though because I need a nap after that. All right, I'll bring the instructions, let's go. <laughs> When you're camping, it's important to get a good night's sleep. So I want to make sure my air mattress is completely filled with air. To do that, I'm going to use one of these. It's called an air compressor. It takes in air from the surroundings and forces it into the air mattress, all with the click of a button. Tell you what, it certainly beats using your lungs. All right, I think that's just about finished. Let's give it a test. Oh, I'm gonna sleep well tonight. Let's get this into the tent. Are you ready, Brendan? One second. Just one more. Good to go. When you're looking for firewood, you want to make sure you get some big bits that'll burn all night and some smaller bits that'll get the fire started. That's called kindling. Let's have a look. Trev, I found a piece over here. I think Brendan's found some. Let's go get it. Brendan, that's way too big. Trav, I reckon if you push and I pull, we'll get this down. There's no way that's fitting in our fire pit. <sighs> Righto, what about that branch? If you give me a boost, <laughs> I reckon we can get that down. Now, you see, when you're collecting firewood, you never want to harvest it from a live living tree. What you want to do is collect what's called dry wood, which you can find on the ground. Here, like this. Dry wood? Why is it called dry wood? Is it because it's dry? That's exactly why it's called dry wood. But you don't have to worry about it, because now it'll fit perfectly in our fire pit. Yes. Yes! I'm the best at Here, well, getting wood. He's collecting kindling, but we need some bigger bits. Here, try this, Hulk. Right up. I don't think he can snap it. I'll, I'll snap this one later. Okay, well, let's go find some bigger bits that'll burn all night. Oh, here's one right here. Now, before we pick it up, we want to make sure we're very careful because underneath you could be spiders, insects, or little critters, and we don't want to harm them or have them harm us. So, you want to carefully pick it up, look underneath, and when you're sure there's nothing there, you can tuck it under your arm and take it back to the camp. Like this? <laughs> well, maybe. I'll go help Brandon, but we'll get some more firewood. Come on. 
Righto, now that it's getting dark and we've got everything we need to start our fire, it's important to remember that fires can be very dangerous. So make sure you've got an adult around you anytime you're near a fire. So what we have here, we have our fire pit to keep the fire contained. We've got our kindling, which is the small sticks to get the fire started, and our bigger sticks. That's to make sure it burns all the night through. And for the adults, our fire starters and our lighter. Let's, Let's get into it. Now we're talking. So what we have here, you'll notice we've set it up into like a little teepee shape. That's because fire needs three things to work. It needs fuel, which is the wood. It needs oxygen, which is the air around us, which will go through the teepee. And it needs heat, which is our flame. So here we go, look at this. Oh, there's one thing, Brendan, I forgot. What? Hang on, it's in my bag. Marshmallows. Oh. You'll never guess what I've brought. What did you bring? In my bag, jumbo marshmallows. Oh, Brendan. All right, so we've set up the camp chairs, the tents are set up, and the fire's going. So Trav, are you ready to try one of my famous roasted marshmallows? I sure am, Brendan. Righto, well while I'm roasting them, why don't you tell everyone what's so great about camping? Sure. Well, I love camping because you're out in nature, you can hear the nocturnal creatures, you got the warmth of the fire and the cool air on your skin and from the smell of it, Brendan's famous marshmallows, which should be just about ready. There you go. Well, I guess it's the thought that counts. <laughs> Thanks for joining us today on another of Active Adventures. We've had such a fun day that Brendan's already gone to bed. What have we done today? We've set up our tent, used instructions, blown up our air mattresses, collected firewood, started a fire, and now, having some of Brendan's famous roasted marshmallows. The only thing now for me to do, finish this and go to bed. Oh, oh, this is everywhere. Ah. Oh, Brendan. Well, we'll see you next time. Remember to hit like and subscribe for our next active adventure.